Hello everybody, welcome to another modern video featuring Vivian on the hunt. Woo -hoo! I've already made a YouTube video with this card and uh, it's been pretty cool. We went 5-0, definitely check it out. Today I'm making some um, adjustment. This list comes from Jeremy Dezani, who won a tournament in Japan with four Renegade Rallyer. This card is sweet. It lets you ramp with your 16 fetches, as well as bringing back an Arbor Elf or an Oath of Nisa, since it's legendary, so that's very cool. The list um, is very similar to the past one. There's also a couple of Sahili Rai, as well as one Birds of Paradise. Cut a couple of Prismatic Ending, adding a second Karmic Guide. I've often asked people, hey, but what if you draw on your combo pieces, then like how uh, you can't win if you draw if you draw the Kiki Jiki, for example, but you're still making a lot of value with Karma Guide, so I think that's fine. And in case you haven't watched the previous video, uh, the the way you can combo is you have any three drop in play plus Vivian of the Hunt, and you turn the three drop into Feather Guardian that blinks the Vivian, that picks up a Karma Guide that brings back Feather Guardian that brings the that blinks the Vivian. You suck Feather Guardian to Kiki Jiki. You reanimate Karmic Guide, you get back Guardian, and then you have the combo. So you need a 3 drop in play to start a chain, and that's why Renegade Rallyer is good. Of course, playing Bound Accomplice can take out Vivian very quickly. And again, uh, the, the past video, we went 5-0. Today, unfortunately, we're starting 0-1. I lost the first match against Lantern Control, which beat me uh, with 2 minutes left on the clock, so I figured I would cut that match and start immediately from round number 2. Uh, yep, so here we go! Join match, vamos! You saw the Renegade Rallyer tweet? Yeah, we had a nice uh, little turn to Renegade Rallyer bringing back Ren and Six previously. Okay, doesn't this not good, but I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I'm gonna go uh, for a breeding pool and an arbor elf. Go. Uh. I couldn't get uh, Stomping Ground. I guess I could have got Naya Land there. Okay, Young Wolf. Interesting. Sahili Rai. Hmm. Okay. We have the Felidar Guardian Sahili Rai combo. Although I am missing Red Mana. Or in Oath of Nisa. That also finds. That also is fine. Stranger Geist. Yep. I've solitude for that. Redland. Nice. Uh, I'm gonna go for Redland. I think I just play Felidar Guardian. A blocker. Hmm. I can actually go solitude on the stronger geist so that they can't get uh, grist. Yeah, I think I'm doing that. Actually, you can get grist even if you suck this, right? Hmm. So yeah, it would be better if I just didn't do it, I guess. But I did, but it's fine. It's a one for one since the Yorin was free. Philipster X. Thank you for the prime sub. Welcome for the fourth month. Appreciate it. 
But yeah, another reason to play this list is because we play 16 fetches. That fixes your four color mana base much better than having Bazages or Rotawar or Ursacans. And 16 fetches, that's it. Also, a, a Naya land over a Jeskai land. Let's go. I'll go Sahili Rai, and that's the combo. Sahili Rai plus Felidar Guardian, an old standard combo. And Yuri Grande wins the match. Woo -woo! Okay, so I'm playing against the. Playing against the. Yagmot deck. Hmm. Well, I want to bring in Endurance. This stops the combo, yes. But, um. It doesn't really interact very well with my combo. I don't want to take out any pieces of it. I guess I can take out Teferi for Endurance. Yeah. Teferi is not great against uh, the Yagmot deck. Of course, it's a white card for Solitude, but as you saw, you have Yorin for Solitude if you want. You want Ashiok. My problem with this card, Ashiok, is that you can't really defend it, and they have a lot of creatures. Maybe on the play I can bring it in, but on the draw, I feel like they can just attack this card so easily, and it doesn't do anything. Hello, Debbie. Okay, very good end. Really good end. I mean, I have Kiki Jiki, which is a blank. It's a card you never want to have in your hand. But other, other than that, the, the rest of the hand is very good. Okay, the Gnoble Iroch. Ooh. I think I just want to bolt the bird here with a prismatic ending. I just bolt the bird. Mm. Okay, scavenging booze. I'll get uh, forest. And I'll get back the fetch land. With Oath of Nisa, you can cast a healer even if you don't have blue mana. Okay, looks like they don't have a um, third land, so I'm definitely going to ping the birds. Then I can go ahead and get, I uh, think, I want to get a breeding pool here. Enchant this with green. And go Oath of Nisa and Arbor Elf. Okay, considering that they're gonna exile my graveyard, I think I want to I actually want to fetch land now instead of Vivian. Maybe that was a mistake. Because I have a lot of lands already with this Arbor Elf with Sprawl. Yeah. Maybe maybe I should have taken Vivian. You just play Yorian. If you have Omnath in your deck, you play Yorian. That's it. If you don't want to play Yorian, you are in denial of the companion mechanic. Which is fine. It's not a big deal to be in denial of things, but... Yeah. Nice start. It's not bad. Yeah. Okay, they still have this green mana up. Which is a tiny bit annoying. Because... Yeah, all right, let's begin with another Oath of Nisa. Uh, what am I looking for? Solitude? Renin 6? Okay, I found a Solitudine. Now, what do I do? Uh, well, I untap this. I have to get planes here to cast Solitudine. Uh, 
Who do I target? Scavenging ooze or birds? Unfortunately, I can't cast Kiki Jiki. I think I'm cutting. I'm just keep on cutting off mine. I don't care if they have ooze. If they want to like top their lands to exile my graveyard, that means they don't deploy. Next turn, I can go Sahili Kopi Solitude. So many people often ask me about playing Yogmoth, and I just can't do it. I just can't do it. I just can't do it. I mean, obviously it's my problem, but I just... Whenever I play against it, I'm like, how do people win with it? It's... Obviously, it has strength, but I just don't see them. Okay. Unfortunately, I don't have Revolt. I'll play Sahili Rai. I'll copy Solitude. Necromancy on Kiki? Yeah. Give me, give me. Give me the Necromancy on Kiki. <laughs> oh, give me the... Uh, how do I tag Grist? I think like this, yeah. E, I got back the Yorian. They don't have Revolt. And you go. I have a revolt now. <laughs> but. Uh, opponent passes with three mana up. Okay, that's a fetch land now. I just pay for Sahili with Oath of Nisa. Uh, 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 um. I'll scry one, bottom. So I want to trigger revolt first. And then I play the um, Renegade Rallier. I have two Four, five, so I have to bring back a land. I have Sahil in play, so the Fighter Guardian will win me the game here. So I reanimate a land. They play Endurance. Eh. Okay. I don't reanimate a land anymore. I have uh, five mana. Yeah, unfortunately it's not six, but that's okay. I can go, you are in. Your free eighth card that draws 70,000 permanents. That blinks 70,000 permanents here. Uh, do I want to blink Renegade Rallier? Probably not. Doesn't much. Okay. I think I want to exile the Dried Arbor. Yeah. And I'll get a land. <laughs> Oh, Sprawl for red. Should have done that. Yeah, should have Sprawl for red. Should have Sprawled for red. Thank you to Olaz Bazaar. Thank you for the tier one sub. Welcome. Thank you, thank you. Appreciate it. 
So like you have ways to stop the combo, of course, even endurance to stop the combo, but you just gain value. It's not like this is not ad nauseum combo. <laughs> you still like play a good deck with Ren and Six and Prismatic Ending and Solid Shit and Yorin and Omnath. So if you play against the deck with Birds of Paradise and Ignoble Hark, you're probably like very favorite regardless of how of the fact that you have Kiki Jig in your hand. That's the good thing of playing combo decks that are just not the, the ton of bad cards. Like, I mean, I, again, I always uh, seem to be mean to poor Yogmot, but sure, you have a combo, but that means that you have to play with stronger guys. I, I just, I don't know. I mean, I play with bad decks very often as well, don't get me wrong, it's just... What do you say are the bad matchups? Uh, it's four color, it's very clunky deck. You got mana screw, you got mana flood, you open hands that do literally nothing. I think this is the best deck in the format, but not this necessarily. Yeah, the four color, you're an omnath, I mean. Uh, not Vivian, uh, but. Okay. What did it lost in the first match? Lantern control. Wow, you didn't take. Okay. Hmm. Let's see what we're playing against. Is that uh, black green saga? Yep. Seems like that. Unfortunately, that thought is not Inquisition, <laughs> the preferred Inquisition. Put it on nine, funnily enough. I'm in the scavenging booze bracket, looks like. Take four, down to 15, then I can get back to Orion. I need to draw the good cards, the Omnath Solitude. Teferi is not a bad start. Hello, Ola Bazaar. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, the Affinity video will be up on the YouTube channel soon. Soon. Scry one. Good luck in your event. Will I play any Pioneer? Um, maybe in the future. Uh, right now, I don't... Uh, I don't know. My future plans for the stream are the following. Uh, this week, I'll keep on playing One League of Modern every day, this and next week, and Standard and Historic to practice for the PT. Then, I want to practice for the Four Seasons Tournaments, which is a Modern and Legacy event. So I'll be playing Modern and Legacy. And when when it all events are over, I guess there is a GP sealed in Bologna, so I can play a bit of that. I can play a bit of sealed too. All right, I keep on casting my Planeswalker. But mostly I like to play formats of uh, events that I have to attend. And in the case of uh, Pioneer, there's no events. 
that I have to ascend. Eggy Benny, thank you for the tier one sub. I appreciate it. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Sadly, it will be a Capenda sealed and not a Double Master sealed. Ooh, it's unfortunate. Yeah, I guess Double Master sealed would be too expensive for a third party. Yeah, these events are not run by wizards. So yeah, that definitely has, um, yeah. I mean, obviously sealed is by far the worst format you can think of for a big event. Uh, but I mean, I guess I've been, I traveled uh, a lot in my, my life for sealed events and I'm not gonna stop now. I'll still go and play competitive magic even if it means playing sealed. No, I think that uh, double master seal. It's fun. It it adds uh, luck to a format that's already very luck. Uh, it's just more fun. If you if you have to go sealed, might as well just go double masters. At least you can open some some bombs and money. Plane bound accomplice. I'm listening. I'm listening. Yeah, right? The best thing for playing limited is an excuse to open in packs. That's true. Actually, this one could have maybe won the game, the emblem. Cinque, quattro, nove. I'm not dead. Do I don't play Bombardment Junk? No, I usually am a competitive only streamer. I try to not play Junk. Okay, Doty with Walker also stops the combo. I'll play Omnat, draw a card. I need like a Solitude or something. Instead, I draw all these bad cards. But obviously, uh, if you put these cards in your deck, you are more likely to draw them. And they aren't very good. Uh, I can fetch and go up to 10 here. If I, oh, sorry, up to nine. They kill this with an insect token and then I'm dead. So I have to go Yorian. But I don't exactly know what can I find. What can I find? Hmm. I don't think I can find much. I guess I wish I didn't crack a fetch. I wish I kept a fetch around. That way I would have, um, I would have gained fought for more life. Yeah, probably. What was your favorite place to travel for Magic Tournament? It, it's Hawaii on Lulu. It's, no. Mm, competitive Magic, you know, isn't the same as before and it's not gonna be ever the same, but I'll always cherish and made memories that I was, you know, staying in the best hotel of Honolulu, paid by Wizards of the Coast to play in the World Championship in Honolulu. Like, that's always going to stay with me. They can never... Like, the, the memories of the, 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 the pro circuit will always stay with me. Do, 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 do. Okay, uh, I have to side in cards against absent cards. Hmm. Absent cards I'm playing against today. 
Endurance is always fine against decks with like mid range piles. I think I'll Sahili Rai for Endurance. Eh, what else? I can take out Planebound Accomplice. Yeah, I'll actually take two out. Yeah. I don't want to go all in on the deck with uh, a lot of interaction. Eighty cards versus sixty-one. Okay. Uh, sure. Do I choose red or white? I think I choose red because I don't have a basic mountain, whereas I have a basic plains. Okay, here's red and ticks. I think I'm taking it. Obviously, I can discard Ren and Ticks, but um, maybe sometimes they don't start with the Thoughtseize. A fetch one would have been safer, I guess. All right. Don't have a Thoughtseize, please. Nice. All right. Let's go to Famous Island Ren and Six Turn, powered by your Oath of Nisa. Formerly banned in Pioneer. Uh, I wouldn't bring in Magus of the Moon. It's mostly for Amulet. Amulet must be a terrible matchup. Remember when Wild Nakata was banned in Modern? <laughs> okay, they don't have a land. That's good. I still can't win this turn, but it will happen soon. Don't worry. Let's play more Oath of Nisa. Take another Vivian. At this point, I have plenty of lands. Actually, this pump the Tarmogoyf. Ah, oh, whatever. Could also go back Yorian. Hmm. Probably thought about that. And I am on my way to win the game next turn with the combo. No. That's fine. That means they have to discard plane bound accomplice, which is, you know, obviously not a good card. So I'm just still on my way to win the game, I think. Slowlier, but I, you don't have to kill on turn four. I've said that multiple times. You think they would have played a prismatic ending on Oath of Nisa? I think it wouldn't have happened now. Okay, so Ren goes to one. I'll kill Ren. And I'll play a Fodor Guardian. Blinking Oath of Nisa. Getting another land. This is the land that makes, that makes the less sense because they don't have a basic mountain. Uh, I just clicked the first one. Since there were three lands. I'll go to 10. Is that a Vindicate? Lillian of the Veil? They Vindicate my land. Cruise.
Yes. Okay, that's the endurance. That's gonna help me shrinking that Tarmogoyf. Now, I mean, I was thinking about blinking that, but then I have to blink this at the end of my opponent's turn. Maybe they like prismatic ending this and I can't blink it. Four mana. Maestrum Pulse. Dai, come Maestrum Pulse? Ma che madonna di carte sono? Ma porco cazzo. Ok. Latio Bono. Why did you overtap? I'll go to four. I don't want to go Endurance. Funny. Uh, actually, what if I cast that instead of Endurance? No, 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 I want to cast Endurance. Yeah. The Tarmogoyf will become a 3-4. I target myself. Thank God I... St oh, no, I put it on the bottom. Cool. I can win the game if I have Endurance plus Vivian. You start the chain with any 3-drop. So I go Endurance and I target myself. And that's a 3-4. And I block. I would have died to an instant removal spell. Turak. Ah! Please don't discard my two Vivian. Okay. We should be good to win now. Bearing any interaction, of course. If the opponent has any interaction, I don't win. But uh, I hope they don't. Let's go. We got Fire Guardian. You blink Vivian. Yes. You got Fire Guardian. You get Karma Guide. You flash back Fedra Guardian. You blink Vivian. Yes. You sacrifice Fedra Guardian. You get the Mirror Breaker. You copy Karma Guide. You flash back Fedra Guardian. You copy the Kiki Jiki. And now we have a loop. Okay. And we did the thing. Unfortunately, you can't uh, shortcut in any way. But that's your two car combo, or rather one car combo. It's just Vivian and any three drops does the job. If they had any interaction, it would have killed you. It's also like graveyard interaction, like a surgical extraction. No, because you can save target with Kiki. Oh, you think so? I don't know. I've tried to do a bunch of shortcut last time and it didn't work. All right, that was powerful. Again, not sure that. 
this is better than playing, uh, you know, normal four color Omnath with interaction, but. Let's go. Oh, peatland. It usually means not enough sources. The discarded Arbor Elf, okay. Hmm. I think I'll go for a forest. Oath of Nisa. Pacify our guardian. Okay, you took a sprawl on a forest. I chose black. Alright, cool. Scavenging ooze. Hmm. That's actually annoying. I think I wanna kill it. It's annoying. It stops the uh, Renegade Rad there, the random six, the combo. I chose to take this so the next turn I can go double oath of Nisa. I think it's time that people bring back spreading seas. So many utopias brought around. Whoa, Graf Digger's Cage. Cool. Birds of Paradise, Omen, I think they get Omen. I wish I could have drawn one of my 16 fetches there. Unfortunately, I can't cast Omen up next turn. Get some lag, got some lag. Thank you for the Prime sub, welcome. I really have a lot of I really have a lot of uh, fetch lines in this deck. Thank you, thank you for the prime sub. Ooh. Next time I can go fight our guardian blink with of Nisa. Attack me for four. Uh, this one says creatures in graveyards. Lovers can't enter, so you can. Can bring back a, a enchantment or land with um, Renegade Rallier. Saving one oath would trigger a Rallier. It would, yeah. They named Omnath. Okay. Yeah, but if I had to save an oath, I mean, I wanted to. I was searching for a fetch land. There's like so many. There it is. Uh, I think I still want to go fight our guardian here, though. I think it's better. And I get. Uh, so, Karmic Guide doesn't work. On the cage because of the cage, it would be good, yeah, but it doesn't work. I'm just getting another another fetch land. Hey, this is a four five. Do you want to chump it? 
Eh, why not? They're confident. <laughs> I'll uh, fetch up an island. I'll go Renegade Rallier. I'll bring back a Plains. And I'll get Yorian. Wish I had Omnath in play. I would have made the GAC uh, much better. Unfortunately, we don't. Because of Cage, I don't win on combo. I can't combo because the combo re requires me to go Karmic Guide. Actually, it doesn't even get creatures from the deck. It doesn't even get creatures from the deck. Eight March video, yeah. If you want to leave a comment uh, on my channel Farble videos, they of course help. You should like the video. Draw Teferi. I like Teferi. Hello. Sahili wins with Felidar. I took it out. I took Sahili out. Sahili Rai. Can I draw Kiki for the win? Yeah, yeah, that's it, I guess. Um, what do I do? Point is beating me down, huh? I can just start with a Teferi bouncing a Tarmogoyf. Then I go to three. I think a red land in case I top deck. Um, Kiki Jiggy. And then I blink to Fairy. And then I bounce the other Tarmogoyf. Poon is on 11. I might actually attack with this Renegade Rallier. I mean, that means they don't blink it if they block with, go with Goyf. But then that means that they... I think it's a pretty good attack. I dive their two removals. Whatever. It's very unlikely. Remember, Frederick Guardian blinks the Planeswalker. It's not like Yorian. That brings back end of turn. Maestrom Pulse. Oh, Araya, that two Maestrom Pulse. Ah, yeah, that two Maestrom Pulse now. Ah, that was a punt. Do they have it? Hello, Chicho. That was a punt. Let's hope I don't get punished. Okay, I don't. They have three Tarmogoyf in end, by the way. Grist. Hunger Tide. 
Hello, Felbin. It's going well. It's going well. It's going well. Pun is on five life with a dark confidant in play. The attack was good. In the sense that we didn't die and it was good. It wasn't a good choice. It just happened to be a good choice now. All right, what did they kill with Grist? Time to put Rhinos into play with Vivian. <laughs> yeah, you certainly can't force to because they have Cage. Cage stops uh, birthing pod actions. They kill their own Bob, yeah. Let's see what creature, which creature do they want to kill. I'm at three life and I don't have any more Omnath because my opponent extirpated them all with Necromantia. Because I had one in end, they knew it. Uh, and they took it. Necromancia is a very good cranial effect. The best one it's ever been. Because it, it doesn't leave card disadvantage. You just give a token in play, which is worth nothing. Or almost nothing. Okay, they killed the, the ooh, Endurance here. That's not the worst. It's not the worst. Uh, do I just go Yuri in here? I think so. I can't fetch to go Endurance and I don't have any more basics. What can I do? Hmm. Let's cast the Yorian. Let's blink a bunch of stuff. All of my guardians. Now, do I play a Fetchland or a Trium? I think Fetchland's fine. Then things will be into play. What do I want to blink? Because this comes in immediately. It doesn't come in at the end of the turn. So things that I can blink are certainly a land so that I can keep up endurance. And what else? I could blink... Uh, I could blink Yorian, but then I die to Pulse. Hmm. Uh, I guess I'm just gonna be boring, blinking Oath of Nisa. Ray? I leave against Pulse thanks to Endurance. Yeah, but. Just having a large blocker, I can even go like block the Tarmogoyf. I think I'm gonna blink out of Nisa. Oh, Solitude, that's nice. We blink out of Nisa. I get a white card. Uh, I think I take white card over Kiki Chiki. I think I'm winning the game without going to combo. So I'll take a white card for Solitude instead. Sorry, Kiki Jiki. If you had one turn earlier, it would have been better. No, actually, I didn't even have triple green, triple red, and then I blink Island, and then I pass with my Endurance up. Okay, they mill one. Uh, so they have sorcery and a uh, creature. I guess they also have a fetch land. So the Tarmogoyf is it 3 4 after I endurance them. I guess I can block with Yorin regardless. You know, I don't need to do much. Who's my favorite planeswalker? It's Teferi here of Dominaria. 
Why not double blink out? Because this way I have endurance up. I'm at three life, I don't have any more basics. Yep, I can bounce uh, the cage and uh, win with the combo. Or just, yeah, no, that, that, that works for sure. Can't the double blink the oath the second fizzles? That's true, I didn't think about that. That's true. I couldn't have targeted two times the oath. That's a play that would have worked on paper though. In paper against me, it would have worked. Or in paper with me, it would have worked because I didn't think about it. Ah. So many plays in paper magic that just slip. Especially with this, I don't know, strange decks. The flexibility of paper magic, right? Exactly. You can't do things, you can't replicate um, with artificial intelligence. <laughs> classic land drop after Wasteland. Or Wasteland, yeah, 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 that's another classic. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> and if you play Vintage, and if you play Vintage, that also happens with Moxes. Because in Vintage, you, like, we have a vintage every month, and you can't remember, can't imagine how many times people make double land drop because with all the moxes, the people are just so far ahead sometimes that you just don't even know what turn it is, and it might just be turn two, you know. Opponent, die yet. Yeah. Yeah, arena, arena. When you target things with word, it does that as well. Yeah. Okay. So they untap. They have three cards in hand. One is a Tarmogoyf. Yep. There it is. I'll cast endurance end of turn. Target you. Cast. Yeah. Yeah. It's all proxies. Every every event is all proxy now. All cards, I mean. I'll fetch. I'll go to two. I get the Jetmir's Garden. Draw now I have a Teferi, so nothing can go wrong. I'll just bounce the cage. And then I go play in about accomplice. I'll go play in bound accomplice. And I put in the Vivian on the hunt. And then I get a Kiki Jiggy, Felidar our guardian, and we win. All right, that's cool. They showed me their hand of Hollywood Moonlight. <laughs> But with the fairy, so I mean, I would have won the game with you are in beat down, probably. But yeah, good games, good games indeed. Okay, uh, I'll take a bathroom break. I come back and we play another match of this.
Okay. Let's go. Third match. The video fourth match on the league. I shall have to refill my water. Uh, GG, AG, TK, GG. Let's go join match. <sighs> Did MTG or reset password? No. MTG will never care about your password. Once again. Keep. Uh, what do I bottom? Hmm. He gets solitude. You're traveling to Italy tomorrow? Cool. A holiday or for work? Stomping ground. Okay. What's that, Jund? She probably. It's probably Jund. Oh, it's. Living End? Looks like that. Asmo. Oh, wow. Ooh. Uh, Temple Garden. And Arbor Elf. If I draw Forest, I win on turn two. I should have probably played this. But I could win on turn two here. Work for a bit and you sting for a month. Wow, that's great. Yeah. Neonate. Huh. They discarded Avengervine. Hollow one. That's okay, you can do your things. Let's draw a forest and I win the game on turn two. Lend! Yes! We win on turn two! Unbelievable! Unbelievable! Alright, let's do this. Forest. I'll put Utopia Sprawl here. I say red, I'll put an F6. We win on turn two. Wow. Get Felid our guardian. Blink Vivian. Get Karma Guide. Reanimate Felid our guardian. Blink Vivian. Get Kiki Jiki, Kopi Karmi Guide, bring back Felidar Guardian, and we have the combo with Kiki Jiki. Boom! Turn two. Turn two, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Ah. 
Okay, Kiki Jiki, Kopies. Feather Dark Guardian. Yes. Two, 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 two. That's cool. Web bricked. That's okay. I'll pass. I was too excited. Oh. Let's hope we can still win the game. How many tokens does this thing need? Two, okay. Hmm. So that can kill the... What do you want to kill here? Cook book. Okay. Mm, am I still able to win here? So I can get Fighter Guardian and then I can get Karmic Guide number two. Yeah, I think I am still able to win. So let's go Mr. Rainforest. Fetch. Then I go Renegade Rallier. Fetch. Get back. Sorry, sacrifice Renegade Rallier. Get Feathered Dark Guardian. Blink Vivian. Sacrifice Feathered Dark Guardian. Karmic Guide. And then I get Kiki Jiki. Now I try not to misclick. Okay.
Okay. Hey, this should be enough, right? Okay. You can't auto anything. Yeah. You have to manually do it. Yeah, unfortunately, we could have won on turn 2, but we have to win we have to win on turn 3. Yeah. That was cool though. That was cool. All right, so I'm playing against a uh, deck where Endurance will be good. I don't think Ashiok will be good once again. Yeah. All uh, cut beat fairy doesn't seem good. Yeah, let's go with this. Am I sure you watch somebody else do it? Could be. Keep. We won on turn two. On turn two, we won. I only didn't because I misclicked. Oh, now you mean? Eh, well, I mean, it depends, but I'll try my best. Um, I think I want to get basics for sure. Yeah, I think I'll get... Oh, I took out the fairy. All right, then it's going to be... Fine, I'll just go red. Yeah, because I took out the fairy. If I didn't take out the fairy, maybe I would have done it differently. Ooh, burning inquiry. All right, good thing they didn't discard my combo. Okay, I'll play uh, a plain bout accomplice here. Planes. So one three you can block. All right. Turn three. Turn three, both of the games, pretty impressive. First one could have been turn two, but uh, that was cool. All right, this was a fast one. He drew, I mean, the opponent doesn't have disruption, so he just drew a combo and got there. Pretty impressive performance so far. You have to play first, yes. Mm. 
Hmm. I'll have to bottom a card. I think it'll be a land. You're surprised we don't play the Dumber's Call. I'll bottom a land here. It'll be this. And then I go Temple Garden, Harbor of. Ooh, Gemstone Cavern. <laughs> this Tim Tutor Fury hopefully will be good enough. Gemstone Cavern off means um, a Cascade. Let's go. Temple Garden, Harbor of. I just play a normal Yorin game. Yeah, that's the goal of the deck. You have the combo, but I mean, if you play against the deck with high interaction, then you just do other things. I guess this is a fire race. Yep. Yeah. Hope I won't be damaged by bottoming the land there. Could have bought from the solid shit, I guess. Had a suspended a crash in footfalls. Hope I draw land. I break. Yep. Bottom the the fetch land there. It's gonna be huge. I guess I was hoping the The three lands would have worked. The two lands plus our would have worked, but maybe that was a mistake. Uh, I think I'll go for a solid shit here. Okay, not dead yet. Okay, good game. I'll bring in the Flusser Storms, and I think that's about it. Uh, what do I take out? Solitude? Endings. I think I'll say Healer Rai. Yeah, actually, I'll keep it ending. Yes. Modern is a reasonable speed. Yeah, very good form. Um, I think I have to get t breeding pool so that I can cast the fear if I draw it. Okay, I wanted to get back Yorin, but I guess I'm casting 
Ran in six instead. <laughs> I can even take a top land now. I'll go check Mirror's Garden. Because they can't uh, cast the thing. I need to have lost a scrum now. So saving two damage, I think, was worth it here. What's the Renegade Rallyer for? It combos with Vivian and uh, ramps up. But mostly just to have a three drop that combos with Vivian. <laughs> Funny. Um, okay. Not a good basic forest here. Funny how you called it. I'll go Renegade Rallier. I'll reanimate a fetch land and I'll get back the other fetch land. Then I think I have to make a land drop. Yeah, no, I did it. Okay, cool. I'll just attack then. No better three drop. That's not the worst. If you think about it. Ran it's ran oath of Nice. I mean it's not great, but it's not terrible. Yeah, Pyro Pyromancer Pyromancer is another great option. Fast games, I like it. Let's go for the finals. Last game of the league. Okay, let's go. Mulligan, despite having uh, Tefiri, which is uh, just best tools against this Cascade decks. Tefiri single handedly keeping the format in check. Without it, the format would crumble. Do I get back Vivian? Do I give back Felidar Guardian? I definitely don't want to get back a land. I think I have a Guardian. I'll just take a forest. Could have bought him the Renegade Rallyer, but this deck plays 16 fetch land, so by turn 3, ideally you draw one. Pyrace. It's okay. I think I want to play this to scare my opponent a little bit. I'm not going to fetch it, just to scare them a little bit of having class to storm.
with the Renegade Rallyer. We won turn two. Yeah, we did. We won turn two earlier. It's a shame that I can't. Should have probably had a flood strain in my graveyard now. So now I, I mean, do I want to take three damage to prismatic ending? I think I'm getting Arbor Elf actually, because now I can win if I draw a Utopia Sprawl. Magus of the Moon. Oh wow. I can't cast ending now. Yeah, I think I lose. If only I had a flood of strand in the graveyard, would have reanimated that, played ending, and had the planes in play as well. It's okay. Good games. Thank you for watching.